So for anyone listening now, and I can imagine there's a few who wants to to skyrocket their careers then, what is the first thing they can do? So it's actually what we just talked about. You need to have a clear career destination. It can't be random. Uh, It can't be too broad and vague because the more specific you are, the easier it's going to be to figure out how to actually get there. So when I think about a career destination, you need to know what is the discipline that you want to work at, the level of seniority, and the specific role that you want to get into. If possible, what type of company you want to work for. Do you want to work for a small startup? Do you want to work for a big corporation? That will make a difference. Different roles show up in different ways, uh, whether you work for a B2B company or a B2C company. So try and figure out what type of company you want to work for. And lastly, what industry? Hmm. Because a lot of the time, if you are looking for a specific role, there'll be nuances based on the industry. And if you have an idea of where you want to go, you can actually create um, an advantage by learning about that industry. So Hmm. what is the type of role, level of seniority, industry, and where you want to work for? For example, for many, many years, my goal was to be a CMO, of a Silicon Valley startup, preferably in the B2B um, product area. But that is very specific. So when I Mm. had to figure out how to get there, and we're going to talk about how to do it in a minute, I had better tools and I could ask better questions. Makes sense. And do you think we should be more overambitious or more realistic when we're sort of setting these goals? Because some people sort of fairly early on in their careers might not know exactly what kind of level they really want to get to or can get to. Yeah, well, you don't have to look like 10 years into the future. Mm. You can just think about the next step that you want to take. Maybe you're just getting started and you want to become a manager one day. So you don't really have to look that far if you don't know what you want. I think, however, a lot of people just don't want to make a decision. Mm. Uh, They're multi-passionate, which is great. And they have different options that they want to consider, which again is great. But at some point, you'll have to make a decision because you Mm. can't be everything to everyone. Mm. And if you really want to guarantee your ability to get to the next level, you need to position yourself as the best candidate. And the only way to do that is to be specific. 